Hello, welcome to Home Cooking with Song Jin. Today, I'm going to cook a very simple vegetable fried rice, or in Thai we call khao pad kana na man hoi. So I have about one and a half cup of cooked rice, one cup of kai lan. For kai lan, I only use the stem part, and one tablespoon of onion oil, one and a half tablespoon of oyster sauce, three pieces of red bird eye chili, one egg, and four cloves of garlic. For the garlic, I didn't chop them. I just cut. Um, I mean, lightly crush them like that. This is very simple and easy fried rice. I guarantee it's delicious. Put in about one tablespoon of cooking oil. Oil is getting hot. I'm going to put in the garlic. We're going to fry the garlic until brown and crispy. When we crush the garlic like this, it's going to take quite a few minutes to fry it until brown and crispy. All right, garlic is ready. I'm going to switch off the heat and remove it from the pan first. I'm going to put this aside. Switch on the heat. Put in the chili. Frying the chili just need to be to be careful. It might cause the sneezing or coughing. But we need to fry it until the chili give out the nice fragrance. Just about 30 seconds and now I'm putting in the vegetable. Put in about 1 teaspoon of oyster sauce. For the kailan stem, it's a bit hard, so we need to cook it for a bit. If you want it soft, you can cook it longer. But for this one, we just need to stir fry with chili for about one minute. Wow! Now the vegetable is cooked and it's soft, so I'm going to push it aside. Just put in half of the onion oil, put in the egg, just need to cook the egg first. Put a little bit of oyster sauce. Okay, egg is cooked together with the vegetable. Now egg and the vegetable is cooked, I'm going to put in the rice. Put in all the oyster sauce. The rest of the onion oil for a nice fragrance. Some of the garlic. Just need a little bit for garnishing. Now we're just going to mix it. Stir fry until all the ingredients combine and now I can taste it. Mmm, delicious. Enough taste and enough flavor. Slightly spicy, so no need to add anything. If you like to add the sweetness, you can put in a bit of sugar. But for this one, it's already tasty and nice. So I'm going to switch off the heat and we can dish out and serve. Now we can top up with the fried garlic. There you go. Very simple. One meal is ready this type of fried rice is already spicy but if you want it more spicy you can eat it with the chili and fish sauce
Mm. Wow, delicious. Very nice fragrance of the oyster sauce and the fried garlic. Vegetable is still crunchy and the spiciness of the chili kick in. Really good. This is really can boost the appetite. Lovely. I like it. I give it a thumbs up. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please share with your friends and remember to subscribe for more of my delicious cooking like this. Thank you and bye-bye.